Welcome back, everyone. Today marks 82 years since the Japanese attack on Pearl Harbor. And this morning, the American Legion Post-19 hosted a breakfast to remember that day. A reporter Eduardo Morales shares why the event is so important to some, especially those who have served our country. The breakfast started today at 9 a.m., where people were invited to come, eat, and listen to veteran guest speakers. The fact that we need to protect our country because freedom is not free. During the breakfast, the veterans were asked to stand up and receive recognition for the sacrifices they have made. Vice Commander Walt Blakesley shares why this event is so important. It's to reflect, remember, honor those who were killed at Pearl Harbor on December 7, 1941. The attack on Pearl Harbor killed over 2,400 people. Even though many people today were not alive on that day, it is still a significant moment in the hearts and minds of many. For me personally, it's a day that I will not forget. I was not born at that time, a couple years later, but hearing about it and watching all the newsreels that came out in my lifetime, we should never forget December 7, 1941. It was a day of infamy, as our past president, Franklin Delano Roosevelt, said. Tracy also has a message for everyone regarding that war. Never forget, we could have been in a worse situation. We could have lost, but we didn't. We stood true to our colors and our national heritage. Vice Commander Blakesley also has a message for the younger generations. It's important not only to me, but to all veterans that the next generation understand that it's going to be their responsibility to make sure this country is defended. The American Legion invites everyone to attend the breakfast in the years to come. Reporting at American Legion Post, Eduardo Morales, 13 on your side.